I never thought I would be a protester. People underestimate the power of a big gathering, a peaceful gathering. I knew natives were connected as a community pretty well, but I didn't think we were connected that well. And the Governor's Mansion walkout, we had a small group of Native students uh, take public transportation down to the Governor's Mansion and we had a peaceful protest outside of the Governor's Mansion. We shouldn't have to be fighting for water, but it's come down to the point where we kind of have to. I'm the Ojibwe teacher, I'm the All Nations coordinator, and I'm an uncle, I'm a cousin, I'm a friend. I'm a lot of different things to a lot of different students. Standing Rock affects me in ways I won't even understand yet until I think it's finally resolved. We have a disenfranchised people and we have this superpower just kind of bulldozing, literally bulldozing over them. There's a lot of miscommunication and it's like two different countries right now, the way that people are treating this issue. It's just like, this country believes that it should go this way, this country believes it should go that way. We need to be a united country about this issue. I have a five-year-old baby sister and I think that's one of the biggest things for me is to show her that your voice is going to be heard, whether you think it is at the moment or not. From the Native perspective, water is one of the main necessities, and our earth is one of the main necessities, and you want to preserve that for the further generations, because it's not just about you, because there's going to be people here after you. How are you going to sit there and face a child who's done nothing wrong and tell them you're not going to have water to drink because I was too scared to stand up for you. It made me very happy to know that a lot of people did actually care about the pipeline and cared about what Natives see as a problem and not that it's only a Native issue but it's a public issue for all humans. It really did bring a lot of people more close to Natives and it really did bring um, us together more as a community instead of separated by different cultures and classes. I worry about all the other pipelines that we have and all the other fresh water supplies that we have that we might not have anymore. And when you make water a struggle, if you make clean water a struggle, we're going to be doing really bad. <laughs>